You were today years old when you learned how to properly apply foam grip tape to a fingerboard. You're definitely going to need some foam grip tape, preferably the secret tape. And you're definitely going to need a soft nail file. You want to apply the fingerboard grip tape to the top ply and make sure there's a little bit of grip tape hanging over on all sides of the fingerboard. I then carefully peel back the nose and tail portion of the grip tape and slide my finger from the center of the board up to the nose and tail to remove any air bubbles. When you start to remove the excess grip tape, this is the angle you're looking for. If you hold the file flat against the top ply, you're going to remove way too much grip tape. Don't hold your file flat to the side of the board because then it's going to leave way too much excess grip tape. When you start to file off the board, the motion is down and away from you in that perfect angle we just talked about. Any leftover grip particles or sticky stuff can be removed by sliding your thumb or finger around the edge of the board. And definitely don't throw away your excess grip tape. That can be used later to make some obstacles non-slip. And here's the final product. You know I had to use the best tape, aka the secret tape, but this method will work with any foam fingerboard grip tape. If you found this video helpful and want more content like this, let me know in the comments below.